Hello and welcome to 3.0 TV. I'm your host Shubham Joshi, and you're watching the Coin Monitor. Virtual digital assets or VDA markets traded mixed in the past 24 hours as investors seized the buying opportunity at lower levels just ahead of Bitcoin halving, a technical event that happens every four years. Bitcoin, the largest crypto, was trading near the $63,500 mark. IC15 index of cryptocurrencies was trading up by 0.3% at 78,840 points. Well, since there will only be 21 million bitcoins, the halving serves to create more scarcity. Well, there is a significant decline in the supply of bitcoin, held by long-term investors on centralized exchanges, reaching its lowest levels in 18 months. Well, this scenario is conducive to further price appreciation, that's what the analyst said. Interestingly, the recent slide in prices of Bitcoin, Ethereum and other altcoins was caused by frail investor risk appetite amid higher for longer US interest rates and escalating geopolitical tensions in the Middle East highlighted by renewed Israel-Iran conflicts. Meanwhile, the South Korean won became the world's most traded fiat currency against cryptocurrencies in the first quarter of 2024. According to a study report published by Kaiko on April 15, the one accounted for approximately $456 billion in trading volume on centralized exchanges, surpassing the $455 billion in US trading volume. Well, in other news, leading investment bank JP Morgan has recommended buying Riot blockchain and BitDeer technologies due to attractive relative valuations. Well, the report captures a general sense of optimism among the industry leaders. Further, the upcoming halving is unlikely to cause a big drop in the network's hash rate, the report suggested. Moving on, Tether and Fuse have partnered to enhance digital asset education and awareness in Turkey and the Middle East. Well, this partnership aims to address cross-border payment solutions, compliance, regulatory framework development and education for the local financial institutions. Well, the global crypto market capitalization was at $2.3 trillion mark, increasing 0.1% in the last 24 hours. However, the total trading volume decreased by 16% to $93 billion. Meanwhile, Bitcoin's layer 2 network Stacks recently launched the Nakamoto upgrade, aiming to transform its infrastructure and shake up the Bitcoin L2 sector. Well, the upgrade will enable faster block creation and validation, analysts said. Furthermore, Arbitrum Network is set to release 92 million ARB tokens valued at around $107 million, marking a significant shift in the cryptocurrency markets. Well, the release could potentially pressure prices and lead to a download catalyst. Whale Alert, a blockchain sleuth, has reported a significant transfer of Dogecoin from Robinhood, a popular investment platform. Over the past 24 hours, several hundred million Doge has been transferred from Robinhood to an unknown wallet. US stock futures traded higher after the S&P 500 notched its third straight day of losses. Futures tied to the S&P 500 increased by 0.18%, while Nasdaq 100 futures gained almost 0.2%. Dow Jones Industrial Average futures rose 0.1% respectively. Bitcoin, the largest cryptocurrency, was trading at $63,370, up 0.2%. Ethereum, the second largest crypto, was up by 0.1%, trading at $3,100. Talking about other altcoins, Solana Sol was up by 2.1% and was trading at $139. Doge, the popular meme coin, was trading up by 1.2% at $0.15. Shiba Inu was trading up by 4%. Next on the list, Ripple's XRP token traded at $0.49, up 0.5%. However, BNB was down by 0.1% to trade at $546. Next on the list, Cardano's ADA token was down by 2.6% to trade at $0.45. While Avalanche AVAX was trading at $34.8, low 1%. Polygon Matic was trading down by 2% to trade at $0.7. Last on the list, Polkadot was down by 1% to trade at $6.7. Well, that's all in today's special segment. This is me, Shobham Joshi, signing off. For most of interesting updates and market analysis, keep watching 3 TV or log on to our website or scan the QR code. Thank you. Auto TV stay connected with the world of blockchain. Stay up to date with infinite world of NFTs. Come explore and evolve with 3 Auto TV in the metaverse. So many coins, so much volatility. 3 Auto TV delivers the news that matters.
Whale Alert, a blockchain salute, has reported a significant transfer of Dogecoin from Robinhood, a popular investment platform. Over the past 24 hours, several hundred million Doge has been transferred from Robinhood to an unknown wallet known as 1WWKF. The anonymous whale has received an, and absorbed several other large meme crypto transactions. As of April 12th, the wallet held 2.4 billion Dogecoin valued at approximately $388 million. Elon Musk, a major Doge fan and meme lover, shared a tweet illustrating the reaction of a Roman legionary and a member of the Roman Senate. The image depicts the legionary laughing while listening to the senator, indicating that mainstream media has reversed its attitude towards Doge, viewing it as a serious asset. After this tweet, the original meme cryptocurrency briefly gained 4%. In the past, the effect of Dogecoin's price caused by Musk's tweet was much larger and lasted longer. A $483 million Bitcoin transfer has sparked interest in the cryptocurrency community following whale alert data. The transaction executed by an entity named 1EOB1 saw 7,690 Bitcoin transferred to Coinbase, the largest US cryptocurrency exchange. The sender 1EOB1 had recently withdrawn $59.97 million from Coinbase Prime. Over the time, the address depleted Coinbase's reserves, leading to the transfer. This transfer coincides with Bitcoin's stable valuation at $63,300 over the past four days following a 13.2% decline and partial recovery. A $322 million Bitcoin influx was also noted on Coinbase Institutional. Speculation suggests that the transfer may be an internal operation by the exchange to reposition Bitcoin assets within its infrastructure or strategic maneuvering by a significant investor capitalizing on recent fluctuations in Bitcoin's price. As the cryptocurrency market closely monitors these developments, attention remains focused on the actions of this mysterious Bitcoin entity. Tether and Fuse have partnered to enhance digital asset education and awareness in Turkey and the Middle East. The partnership, which includes a Memorandum of Understanding, aims to address cross-border payment solutions, compliance regulatory framework, development and education for local financial institutions. Tether's initiative promotes cryptocurrency adoption through educational campaigns promoting Bitcoin, blockchain and stablecoins like Tether for cross-border payments. The partnership also focuses on developing programs and workshops to enhance awareness on digital assets and blockchain technology among local financial institutions and individuals. The partnership also aims to educate merchants and businesses on the practical utility of digital assets like Bitcoin and Tether for everyday transactions. In the upcoming segment, we will update you about the following news. Crypto ATM firm says revenue unaffected by fluctuations in Bitcoin price.